Hello everyone, see some of the clay activities. We have taken these clay cylindrical already created three and we are just clustering them together and after that making some of the lines and placing some of the beads or the dates at the center and with the help of the hands creating such beautiful patterns. These activities are quite interesting and quite good. They are somewhat we can see relaxing. So you can definitely give them a try and you may require some of the shaping tools or we can see some of the tracing tools for this one like here some of the sticks some of the combs and some of the tools that will squister it together with the help of your hand you can also squister them properly here you can see we have just made some of the dotted lines with the help of the comb and now some of the trims with the help of the trimmer or the knife and then with the help of the fingers giving them a proper type of the petal type of the look as apparent on your screen. if we talk about the difficulty level it's easy but it's quite time consuming moreover it requires a careful attention for creating such patterns Let's now move further with our another activity here. We are taking these two chapatis, making some of the lines and the cards at the center. We are placing some of the dates. You can make use of the artificial beads as well. You can see some of the leafy type of the patterns we have made. Now we are placing them one after the another in the opposite direction and with the help of the scissors, we are making some of the cuttings as shown here. Once you are done with all this, squish them properly with the help of these chopstick inspired tool. Now you have to make rest of the three chapatis, trim them at the center, insert some of the patterns and after that fix them properly over the bead or any date and you can see such a beautiful flower we have created let's now move further with another activity you can see we have rolled down some of the circular chapatis one and now we are just rolling down the same way that's the another one in the similar manner now after that with the help of these sticks we are just inserting them and creating a kind of the mountain look at the center with the help of the scissors we are trimming down the petal patterns type of the area with the help of the hands you just have to squister them properly and the knives are used for creating such smooth patterns this is so good and so easy but it's really time consuming consuming activity definitely give this one a try let's now move further with our another activity for this one we are taking these cylindrical shaped doughs and after that we are making some of the patterns with the help of the comb trimming all the sides with the help of the knife and squistering together with the help of this chopstick inspired tool from the center area we are placing some of the dates and giving it a look of a flat now we are taking the four chapatis making some of the patterns with comb cutting them down at the center and now you just have to roll over your date or any bead over it with the help of your fingers roll it properly and you can see this beautiful flower and you have to place it at the center now we will move towards another activity for this one you may require three chapatis you just have to roll them as you have done for the earlier activities you just have to repeat the same process for rest of the two and then you can see you are placing all these three together these activities are quite good definitely give them a try and now with the help of the sticks twist them properly from all the ends and then insert a beautiful data at the center you can see we are beautifying it from all the sample ends and making some of the petal portions it looks quite easy thank you for for watching